Hello and welcome back to Chasing Time. Alright, we're back in the past. Dr. Laura has sent us back. We found non-Dr. Laura before she became a doctor on her farm with her dad. And now we've got to go and find the source of the virus, which is conveniently down the road. So let's go have a look. I'm assuming that it's going to be this building just down here. I find it slightly strange that Dr. Laura lived so close to the source. Although this building is slightly small, it may not be like a research lab or something that, you know, had a virus born out of it, but it does have the medical cross in it, so maybe that's what it is. Let's have a look. This is the place. Use your axe to break the middle bottom bookshelf. Whoa. How inconspicuous. Let's go down. Yep. A whole research lab. Let's loot it. It's not my fault by Dr. Hoo Woo Woo Kuma. Keep that. I don't think we need anything else from there. Is that Dr. What's his face? This brain is useless. Oh, there he is. Probably one of the villagers. You would be correct. Whoa, hello. Are we supposed to fight? Whoa, jeez Louise. Alright. Am I like withered? Wither skeletons. I'm gonna get boxed into a corner in a second. Come on. What's my name? Matt. Let's go, Matt. Let's do it. Oh, yeah. Take that. Why are you doing this? As I still get withered away. Just trying to save my daughter. Apparently I understand. I don't know if that's... Have you lost your daughter because you weren't paying attention? She can't move. I don't have a daughter. She can't remember her family. Whoa, okay. Wow. So there was a car accident. And it was his fault. You're right, I can't, but... You'll never know the pain of those who are going to suffer because of what you are doing. They're going to lose their families just like you did. You don't know that! Well, I, uh, you know, I do actually. Oh, I'm going to show him the future. This is what you do. No guarantee that we'll be able to survive or find a time machine. We need him to understand the consequences of his actions. Why can't we just kill him, like, um, Miles Bennett Dyson in Terminator 2? That would work. Oh, here we go. Whoa. Whoa. This is what you did. Eight years in the future. It already has caused it to happen. Every one of those people down there had a family. Now they're one big zombie family. If anything, he's brought people together. You're going to lose their daughters just like you did. All of them had only daughters. She wouldn't have wanted for thousands of innocent people to die for her life. Is that thousands? Probably more like 30. Any spare time she'd have, it'd be spent helping those in need. Oh my god, everything's blowing up. Causing a paradox. Oh my god. No way for the doctor to change his mind. Well. That has destroyed that. And now we're falling back to earth. Whoa. Oh, hello. 
Hello, Laura, again. Are you okay? Is the virus gone? Who are you and what virus are you talking about? Well, yeah, I mean, we did just stop it from happening. But she wouldn't have known anyway. She didn't even know about the virus previously. Ugh. Have we met somewhere? Oh no, wait, this is Dr. Laura, because she's wearing the doctor's arm. Oh, I'm confused now. Time travel. We've met in a different world, in a different time. You changed the world, Laura. Chasing time by Vu6. Oh wow, it's over already. Well, okay. This doesn't really need like two episodes. I could have done it in one. Oh well. Uh, we'll still go on like this anyway. But we'll go through the credits. Font created by Lithnos. Royalty free music by 99 Sounds. Lighting add on by The Borm 64. Piano music by Furby Guy and Frankham. Windmill by Mr. Alexander 137. Woodhouses by Linecraft. Barn by Raf 609. Modern Houses by Jar 9. Models by Vu6, Story by Vu6, Textures by Vu6, Command Block Work by Vu6, Bug Tested by MewVu, Cloudwolf, and Pikavu. Very cool. This is a very well made, made map. It was short, that's for sure. This is Titan. He's the beast that powers the entire map. Damn. That is a building of a lot of redstone and command blocks. Very impressive. That must have taken a lot of time. Wow. Very cool. Cool story. Well made. I do think, though, that it could have been slightly longer. It felt like it was a little bit too easy to convince that doctor, who was actually a little bit mad, that he had done something so catastrophically evil, and then to change his ways. Usually in the movies it doesn't go that easily. But that's okay. We've done it. We've saved the world. Now our time here is done. Whee! Oh, shit. I didn't even know what I hit. Oh, well. Anyway, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, give us a thumbs up and subscribe. I'm hoping to do more uh, adventure maps like this. There's a heck of a lot of good ones out there, so I'm going to start going through them. But um, thanks for watching. And... If you want to see anything in particular, just let me know in the comments below. Thanks!